five minutes. Welcome in, Rays fans. We are back at Michigan for Wicked Wednesday Truck Series. And we'll begin right after this. Give proof. 
What the hell? I don't know. I don't know. What? It's broke. It broke. What's broke? My music. What the hell? Oh, wait. Maybe. Maybe it isn't broken. Well, why I was going to say, I heard it initially, and then you stopped oh. it. Oh, my volume's down. Oh, jeez. Here we go. My volume is down. Welcome in, race fans. We are live at Michigan. What's going on, Night Cop? Thank you very much for that lovely, lovely, lovely host over there on Kick. We are live on Kick YouTube and Twitch tonight on this Wicked Wednesday for the Automaker 250. Along with myself, Dead Man Strolling, I'm being joined tonight by Sir Brazy Balls, a bull. How are you doing tonight, Mr. Bull? I am doing all right. How are you doing tonight? I'm doing okay. Fantastic. Holy shizit, look at this. Big right over there on, on Twitch. Thank you very much, Night Cop. Very much appreciate it. Welcome in, Raiders. Welcome in, Hosters. Welcome in, welcome in to all. We are looking for a great night tonight. 29 trucks on the track. What? What? And that can't be right. Burns number one. No. Nah, Burn didn't take the pole. Come on. No, I don't think that. I think they just went into the drivers meeting. And to tell you the truth, I don't think they've even qualified yet. Nope. No qualifications up there. Hey, that's typical Vern right there. No qualification. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's going on, gamer? Uh, I don't race gamer because if I raced, people would be pissed because I always would win. Because you'd crash everyone else. Hey, a win's a win. <laughs> Man, we are on the ball again tonight. Are we? I think so. Okay. Hey, uh, welcome to the deplorables there, Gray Wolf. I very much appreciate it. Big old follow over there on Twitchy Poo or Twitch. Is it Twitch? Twatter? Twatter? No, Twitcher. Twitcher. I don't know. Uh, I you really are don't know. Deplorable. Yes, you are. You are now, anyway. Especially following me. What the hell? Anyway. Any uh, track knowledge tonight there, sir, Brazy? How about, how about some track temperatures? Hun yeah, get the track temperatures up there. There we go. So this is a two-mile D-shaped oval track. I don't know how it can be D-shaped and oval. Like, how does that make sense? It's Detroit. Nothing makes sense. <laughs> Nothing makes sense. I mean, look at the pot smoke going across the track again tonight. Still hasn't cleared up. Still hasn't. I mean, it, it doesn't surprise me. I should it. It is Michigan. Okay. Anyway, is that it? Is that all you had? I mean, there's there's uh, uh oh my God. camping options available. There's really there's, camping there's options. All kinds of stuff. Yeah, there's camping options. We just had three more trucks, which is going to put us at 32 trucks tonight. Oh my God. Oh. All right. Let's go down that list. Son of a bitch. All right. I, I think I can do this. Uh, breathe, dead man. Breathe. Tonight on the track, we're going to have Vern Bradley, Brad Patterson, Michael McCulley, Chuck Sweeney, Hal, Amy, John Wimbish will be joining us tonight. Ivan Jones, Richard Holland, Tommy Hayes, Ray Zero Cut. Razor Cut. Zero cut. Razor Cut. Okay. Brian Miskill. Glenn Jameson, Rick Ragone, Elsie Daly. Yeah, and that John Deere truck will be out tonight with Lance Yancey, Garrett Hel Helminger, Burt Wilson, TJ Lee, Paul Patterson, Travis Smith, Nick Hunt, Roy Hyde, Brian Rainville, Ray Chess, Cody, uh, Cody Williams. And it just all swapped on you. And it just all <laughs> swapped on me, so I have no idea where I left off. 
a shit ton. How about that? So do we have brothers in here tonight? I don't know. Do we have brothers in here tonight? I see a Brad and a Paul Patterson. Hey, yeah, uh, could be. Could be. Are we still qual are we qualifying? Yeah, okay. I was gonna say LZ Daily took the poll. Come on now. I mean it wouldn't be the first time. Oh no, not that he couldn't do it. I just you know. Did he do it again? Hey, where's that uh, Austin Ricky Bobby Powers or whatever the hell? Or is he just a, is he just a, uh, he might a, just be a car guy. Is he just a car guy? Is he just a car guy? Well, we lost some drivers too, so we must have had some people bag out. They just came in for practice. I don't know. Something. Confused. Ah. Uh, Uh, I heard there was an accident at a racetrack where a car went into the crowd. Anybody know anything about that? No, sir. No, sir, I don't. There's, there's still 32 here. Oh, well. There's not numbers on the site, so I couldn't count. All that fog I mean, is bad tonight. There's tons of cars that have gone into the crowd in history. I'm assuming he means recently. Like, you know. Come on. Well, I mean, he didn't specify. He just said, I heard there was an accident where a car went into the, into the race. Into the crowd. Mr. Beans, be Beansy Bean. What the hell kind of... What the... How do you... How do you... How do you Mr. come up Beansy with Mr. Bean. Beansy Bean? I'm just curious. Like the name. And thank you for the shout out. Uh, happened this past weekend there. So there you go there, Google head. Just go ahead. Figure, figure it out. Hey, look at that. Right now, we've got Dakota Floyd sitting on the pole. I'd tell you who are watching, but I can't. Oh, there it is. 43. The fog's so goddamn thick, I can't see nothing. See, fuzzy nuts. Uh, Ray Chass, let's go ahead and take a look at him as he's running his qualifying lap. Wow. Razor cut. Razor cut coming around there with a 39.67. Nick Hunt just came in there with a 39.62 and another John Deere. Wait a minute. We're not allowed to have two John Deere's nice. on the track. I like it, guys. I no like it. way. I protest. Okay, Nick Hunt's so it best was... time, 39.62. So it was a rally car in Hungary that went into the crowd and killed four. There you go. Didn't even know they had races in Hungary. <laughs> they really rallied around him. Wow. That's too soon. Oh. The hell do I care? I don't know, if I don't it's know too anybody. Soon, in... But it's <laughs> the hell do I care? I don't know anybody in Hungary. Oh, I'm not saying that you care. It's just kind of. I had a moment of silence kind of a for bad him. Joke. That's more what I was going after. It was just a bad joke. Oh. You know, kind of a groaner. They they really put their back into it. Wow. Enough. And this is what we get to look forward to tonight, guys. Craps <laughs> on the pole, uh, Nick. All right. There we go, Nick. Uh, well, I think we're going to learn. The thing is, name's not Mike. 
Uh, we actually have a guy at work. And his name is Mike Hunt. <laughs> Poor guy. All right, there we go. Look at that. Here we go. There is your starting grid, Nick Hunt. Uh, we'll take Wait, pull. What? what? Number two. What are you talking about? Burn. Can I read this or are you going to interrupt me all night? Fern Bradley is going to take second, razor cut, third, Dakota Floyd, fourth, Gray, Garrett Helminger is going to be in fifth spot tonight. LZ Daly is going to be in sixth. Brian Misco will be starting seventh. Ray Chest will be starting eighth. Burt Wilson, ninth. Roy High, tenth. Take it from here, Brazy. Lance Yancey is going to be 11th. John Wimish is 12th. Tommy Haynes in 13th. Mike McCauley is 14th. Ivan Jones, 15th. Cody Williams, 16th. John Snoo is going to be in 17th. Craig Lerman is going to be 18th. Mike Mitchell will be 19th. Steve Seegers will be starting in 20th. Chris Car uh, Campbell is 21st. Glenn Jamison, 22nd. Chuck Sweeting, 23rd. Ricky Fagone, 24. Richard Holland, 25. Travis Smith is going to be 26th. Sean Hopkins is 27th. Al Amy is going to be starting in 28th. Really? <laughs> Brad Patterson is going to be 29th. Brian Rainville is going to be 30th. TJ Lee in 31st. And starting at the back of the pack is going to be Paul Patterson. Very good job. And that's uh, Hel uh, Helmlinger. for the year really 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 is that what you Good. live for tonight is that what you're gonna live for tonight you're gonna come back 20 minutes after a conversation and, and then correct me you got mad because i interrupted you so wow. i waited for you to go wow. through without interrupting you and then i was going to tell you when you stopped reading but then you had me finish so here we go we're getting ready to line up and get green ready to go green 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 Huggity buggity buggity. See, I threw a huggity in there so it wasn't copyright. Hazy wazy daisy in there. It's exciting. So, Mr. DMS, how many yellow flags will we see tonight? Uh, I'm going to go with four. I don't know that I'm going to guess because I guessed three last night and we went with zero. So hopefully the sun will come out pretty soon because you can't see shit. Pace cars down. We are ready to go, and we're going to go right into a crank it up. Green, green, How you doing, Cindy? How are you doing tonight? Good evening, Cindy.
I think it's foggier tonight than it was last night. Yeah, and camera one is really horrible. At least you can see the outlines of the windows. <laughs> What's up, baby girl? How you doing tonight? Welcome to the broadcast. We can't see shit coming in out of that turn right there. Not it. Garrett gonna drive down to the inside with Brian Misko. Going to challenge that lead right off the bat. Razor cut in behind Nick. And look at that. Look at that Vern Bradley. Look at that Vern Bradley up there get, causing trouble already. God, that turn is so sure, terrible. I'll take, I'll take your word for it on that corner. Yeah. <laughs> it is so horrible. <laughs> Makes you wonder why they even do that shit. <laughs> Nick, Nick Hunt going to force his way back up front. There you go. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better myself. <laughs> you probably could have, but. And even if I would have, it wouldn't have mattered to you to just interrupted me anyway. Bam, baby. Who's in first now, bitch? <laughs> I don't know. One of them. Two John Deere trucks on the track tonight. Love to see it. Uh, let's see if they finish the race. My luck, my luck, they'll finish first and second. <laughs> Nick gonna get a, go ahead and get a good push on the outside there. Sure. And I'm looking down through, it looks as if Brian Rainville, Shane, Sean Hopkins and Paul Patterson are not going to be completing. And TJ Lee is already. Good evening, Emily. A little bit of truck problem for TJ Lee, I'm sure. Is the truck problem or is the ticker not ticking? Mm. All right. He hasn't even run a lap yet. Oh, okay. Or he doesn't even have a time yet. He has run. No, he hasn't. He's not. Yeah, there he is. There's nothing what? wrong with my ticker. <laughs> okay. I hope it's as clear as that fog is. It's as clear as that fog. Garrett going to drop down to the inside. He's got Brian Misko in there behind him. And who that, who that behind him? Oh, that'd be Roy High in the double zero. Sure. All this fantastic footage, and I'm not gonna be able to use any of it because I can't see nothing. Well, you know, Navy Nation showed up and everybody had a pot party and that's this is, these are the results. So how long before we go three wide? Well, I thought we already hit that again tonight. I thought we did that during the uh, crank it up. Uh, not technically. We got an outside group going in there and Garrett Helminger is going to go ahead and take that first spot from Nick. And look out, Brian Misko's looking to the inside. He is looking for that P2. Razor cut, Burn Bradley, Roy Hyde's gonna finish off your top six. And there he goes, down to the inside. It, it, 
looks like Vern gets close to him, but then it cuts to the next camera and it's not as close as it looks, but. There you go, there's three wide. Yep. Three wide in the corner fog. Well, there we go. That's our top six. We're going to drop down here to the top 10. And look at this battle. John T. Wimbish, Michael McCauley, Lance Yancey, Elsie Daly, Ivan Jones, and Glenn Jameson, Tommy Hay, 10 through 15. Take a look. <laughs> Let's go to the Amy contracting blimp and see what we can see. <laughs> oh, oh, beautiful. Yeah, beautiful. beautiful. As you can see, they're racing really hard tonight. What a beautiful looking field that is. <laughs> oh, this fog is horrible tonight. No, we're going three wide into that corner. Is there jostling around right here and in the front of the pack? 14 laps down. And the thing about it, let's, let's go take a look at in and jump in with the 31 of Richard Holland. Look at this. They're still grouped up. There you go, Richard Holland. And right there behind him is his teammate in the three truck there, Hal Amy. And Rick is on the outside. This is better than you thought it was, huh, Gamer? Definitely gotten worse since last night. I mean, we get to see pretty much all around the track except for that one corner. And when we go over to camera one, you can't see shit. That looks like some exciting racing down there. Cars shifting, shuffling around. At least it's not brown, is it? At least it's not brown, it's true. I mean, we were debating last night if it was extra fog or if it was pot smoke. So, I mean. You know, a race like this, you, you sit back and you think about it and you go, hmm. It's not that it isn't going to happen. It's when. Do we go caution free tonight? Mm, I think we're <laughs> going to have at least one. We got four wide back there.
our leader right there is i guess go ahead and get us through there uh the top 10 there all right so first place is garrett hemmingler and you got nick hunt in second cameraman cameraman razor cut is currently running third with brian miskell now taking third he just ain't getting away for the he just ain't getting away for the camera guy right i see how you are and Vern's fifth Roy Hyde is going to be sixth. Greg Lerman is currently in seventh for their biggest biggest jump of the night. 11 places so far. Up 11 John spots. John Kunish is eighth. Tony Haynes is ninth. It's and Tommy Bert Haynes, Wilson. but you know, Tony, Tommy, Tommy, you know, it's okay. Tomato, and tomato, Wilson's potato, potato. Round out your top ten. There you are. There's your three wide. Bert Wilson in that milk duds. Milk duds truck tonight. Mm, changing it up. Brian Miskell in the 44 is going to get to the front with Roy Hyde in behind. Not sure what happened to Garrett, but he's dropping quick. Yes, he is. And then you got uh, Roy Hyde. He's looking in the inside. He's trying, but I don't think he's going to be able to do that. Twenty-two laps down. Bert Wilson up there saying, "If you're going to let me go up here, I'll, I'll gladly come up here with you guys." Yep. That that milk isn't a dud tonight. Okay, I'm even going to admit that that was bad. <laughs> I was I was letting it be. to have a three wide there. And that's what you take a look at what Brian Miskell's seeing in his mirror. Trucks all over the place. At that angle, it looked like we were almost going four wide. But it wouldn't be that crazy. Come on. Yeah. Not yet. Craig Learman in at the 43 truck. He's moving up to the top five. And look down and below. Look at this. Vern Bradley. He's going to try and get up there. This is a blast to watch. Y'all keep this going. He's well, thank gonna, you he's very gonna much. Be, he's going to be doing the shake and bake slingshot move there. Yes, he has. Burn Bradley moving up to third and challenging that P2. 
But Nick has got a little bit of help behind him with Roy Hyde. And that devil's there. See how I see how you put emphasis on certain things, certain words. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. certain drugs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Makes it exciting. It engages the audience. At least that's what they tell me. And as soon as I get confidence, I'm just going to broadcasting. Oh, again? Maybe. Vern Bradley challenging that first spot on the inside. Not really a lot of help, but we've got the 25, a razor cut coming up. And oh, it, 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 easy there, Kelly. It gets it straightened back out. And look at this. Look at this. Vern Bradley trimming the grass. You know, he's probably just getting a little bit, a little bit extra cash, a little bit extra cash. And Vern Bradley is going to move up to the front. Oh, oh, yellow, 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 yellow. I'm sorry. I felt there wasn't no block until that pin. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. Vern Bradley taking over the top. And then we just had uh, Greg. 44. No, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to go back further than that. Damn it. What if you click the uh, pass right before it? No. Oh, well, uh, we got to see it twice. You know what? I can do this. Look at this. Huh? Huh? There you go. Well, we got him coming down. And there it is. There it is. Look at all of them coming down pit road. Oh, it, what, what the hell? Now that's not me. I have no idea what the hell is going on. Something about pit road and, and the cars and your computer. Uh, I'm not sure what it is, but uh, they don't like each other. I'm not, I'm not showing anything on my end. No idea what the hell all that was about, but we got it all squared away now. Yeah, that, that, was, that wasn't me. I'm not showing any drop frames. I'm not showing anything. Not it. No, no, it's not that. Anyway, there we go. Brian Miskell, he's up here at the front, the 44. He was involved in that last caution. After watching the replay, it was uh, 44 who came up and hit the 14. Straight away, 44 will get the EOL. And there you go. You hear him coming down. And the 44 is going to go to the back of the line. Okay, what, 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 what the hell? <laughs> what, 
what in Sam's hell is going on? It's the fog. Fog's eating the cars. That was weird. Yeah, there you go. See, it's not just me. They're talking about it too. <laughs> Aliens, man, I'm telling you. Pace car, he just said, the pace car keeps disappearing. All right, lights are out off the pace car. Pace car is down. We're about to go. Green, Nick Hunt, LZ Daly, Roy Hoy, Cody Williams, Greg Learman, Burt Wilson, John Wimbish, Tommy Haynes, Travis Smith, and Ivan Jones, your top 10. And here we go. Daly up back up to the front the second spot Roy Hyde in behind him click Craig Learman Cody Williams John Wimbish Travis Smith and Burt Wilson Tommy Haynes and Evan Jones three wide Definitely tempting fate there. Seven there, just getting a little looser. Travis Smith, Burt Wilson in behind him with his teammate John Wimbish. I mean, not John Wimbish, Clint Jameson. Don't say wait a minute. I don't know about you, but I'm thinking this fog has something to do with it. What's That's up, Diana? How you doing? What's that? That is a very good possibility. Good evening, Diana. It's always that goddamn corner right there. Look, there they go again. Blinkity blink blink blink. I'm using 3.1% of my computer. No drop frames. 60 FPS. Well, that'd be different than what the game's running though. I know. That's what I'm saying. I, I just letting everybody know that. It is not me. But then again, it could be. Travis Smith in the 97 going to go to the inside, being pushed over there by Roy Hyde. 
He's going to challenge Nick over there for the first place, and we're going to try to call this as best as possible. Kurt Wilson and Glenn Jamison are going to come up behind there and help push. Just like that. Just like that. It's aliens, I'm telling you. Well, it's Michigan, so. Hot smoke, aliens, three wide. Three wide into that corner and you can't see it. <laughs> because it's either the fog or the cars disappear. One of the two. But we're gonna give her hell and just do, roll with it. If I smell smoke, ah, shit. Don't go jinxing yourself like that. Nick Hunt gonna get right on the bumper there of Travis Smith. Meanwhile, Roy Hyde driving down to the inside. interesting how many of the guys hang to that outside and how many try and go on the inside and it's like that outside line just seems to be just slightly better around yeah. the track oh this is fucking horrible We're at a disco. Nightclub racing in Michigan. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Got DJ Dead with Braddy Braze. Oh, yeah. You're running around with the flickety flash of the fast cars, fast trucks. All right, so we got to figure out what could this problem be? Being that some of the drivers are also seeing it, I'm guessing it's a server issue. And the fog probably is not helping. Those guys are getting awfully close on that spot. Yes, they are. But Burt Wilson is not backing off. He is going to drive down back to the inside and they're gonna just net code the hell out of it. And it, 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 it's always that corner. What the hell? Look at this, Burn has managed to get his way back up, to, up there. Yes, he has. He's currently running fifth right now. He's going to drop in behind the 63 of Glenn Jamison. And look at all these teammates all on the inside. Glenn Jamison. Burt Wilson. Fern Bradley. Brad Patterson is going to be getting into that action too. And that 42 truck. And then what do we got going on here? The 28 of Cody Williams is going to drive down, cut a little bit of lawn, and we've got a little bit of action up front here. Get, get, get. And look at that. The 44, 44 Brad Miskos moved all the way back up to 10 spot so far. So both cars involved in that last caution are getting back in it. Oh, 
another three wide. Ow! And we got a we got a rat. Got yellow, yellow, yellow. Oh shit! It well, it was a big one. Dude, I. It's even doing it on the replay. It looked like 44 went sideways. I don't know if he got hit. It looked like he might have been three wide. Yeah, it's even doing it on the replay. Pace car is out of two. See if we can take a look at it. Yep. And 44 is gonna go is gonna go sideways. Yeah, okay. This is definitely on the replay. So this is on their end. Has to be. I'm going to own that caution or I got to go out and look and watch the replay again. I could not see or make out who it was that turned him, but it looks like the 44 did get turned. Leaders are coming down. The whole crew is coming down to pit, and I'm going to get the hell out of pits before that ever half shit happens again. Oh, it's still doing it. Yeah. Something, something with pits. All right, Between the pits and the fog. Not, you're going to pass through under green. We apologize. We're having technical difficulties tonight. No idea what's going on. I'd almost want to, you know, almost thinking about shutting it down, but it's nothing on my end. Because even in the recording, if you look, it, they're blinking out at the same exact time. Taco, we're not sure. On that last restart, they were talking about the same thing we were seeing where the pace car and cars were just blinking in and out. So the drivers are seeing it too. I think. That's what I heard. That's what they're saying. They're seeing something, and we just don't know if we're seeing it at the same level. Yep. Here's the 86 right there, the Luke Oil of John Sanu. Let's take a back here and see if we can't go and check out Paul Patterson. Yeah, see, this is a replay. I mean, this shit ain't even live. Black, black, black. And they're blinking at the same spot. No. Right. We're going to extend the caution another lap so McCulloch can catch up. He had to get out and review that. That's why we like to use the honor system. Yep. That feller not only didn't honor it, but he left after he got his finish. So we're going to extend that. We're going to extend the caution one more lap. While everything is under review. Same color, black flag. Stay away from the fog. Well, that would be. That would. That would not be a bad deal. 
except for the whole goddamn thing's fogged out. <laughs> well, you know what? I could do this so that we won't see the cars disappearing. It'll happen. Yeah, but we're not seeing it. <laughs> See if I hold on a second. Come on, back out of that. Back out of that. I'm really not. Um. did seem to clear up for some reason all right here we go we're back and uh, we are back under green here in about green, green, green. a tenth right of a now. second John Sanu in the 86 there is going to be rounding off your number one spot. Nick Hunt, Travis Smith trying to get this shit done before they get into the fog, but Burt Wilson. Burt Wilson's going to be fourth. On the outside of him is going to be the 24 of somebody we haven't mentioned tonight, Dakota Floyd. And right behind him is going to be Chuck Sweeney and Glenn Jamison with Vern Bradley down on the inside. Christ. Gamer, wasn't there a, a thing in there? You got to stay away from the sink too, right? Didn't, didn't something come out of the sink and grab the one person? When the fog surrounded the house. I saw that movie, The Fog. Trying to check on John, uh... Dave Ricky. And there we go. There's John Sanu. God damn it. Yep. Try and keep just continue on. We've got 52 laps. We only got another fucking two hours of this shit. <laughs> okay, not two hours. Travis Smith is your leader. Nick Hunt right in behind him. Burt Wilson is in third. Glenn Jameson.
Crazy, I'm getting a little bit PO'd. <sighs> it's fine, it's fine. Just play through it, play through it. What do you, you want to play? Bad, Spades, Jin Rubby, Canasta. All the old uh, folks out games. Of those, the only one I know how to play is Spades, so. You don't know how to play Canasta? Oh, you're not old enough yet. Yeah, I have not joined your league yet. A candy crew up there working on trying to get in front. Yes, they are. Candy crew, the sweet treats. Sweet tarts. Maybe if you try to read out the top 10. Yeah. All right, so currently you got first place is Travis Smith. Nick Hunt. <clears throat> Nick Hunt. Uh, Burt Wilson is going to be second. Travis Smith is now third. Vern Bradley is now third. Travis Smith is now fourth. Glenn Jameson is going to be fifth. And that's 63. Cody Williams in that 28 is going to be your sixth place car. Brad Patterson in the 42 is going to be your seventh. Up 22 spots. John Wimbish in the 56 is going to be eighth place. Richard Holland in the 31 is going to be ninth. And Dakota Floyd is going to round out your top 10. Right behind him, you're going to have Steve, and, uh, Steve, Steve Seegers, Chuck Sweeney. Michael Mitchell, Roy Hyde, and Ivan Williams. Wait, who? Wait, who's number 15? Who's 15th place? Ivan jo oh, Ivan J Jones. <laughs> I don't even know how you did that one. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't even see a Williams on the screen. Oh, there he is. Cody Williams on number, number I'm fifth. pretty okay. sure there's an Ivan Williams <laughs> out there somewhere in America. Uh, question. Are the drivers dealing with the fuck? Yes, they are. We can hop in the car with them and show them. We sure can. Let's go ahead. Hey, let's go ahead right now with Dakota Floyd. Bradley going to drop down to the inside. He's back up to the front. And here comes the 63 of Glenn Jameson. Burt Wilson on the outside. And of course, I knew it was too good to be true. And look who's sneaking up there that we haven't talked about much tonight. Fifth place. Currently. I know. Coming in in fifth right there is going to be that 31 of, as you can see, him going. As you can see between the flickers, if you blink Richard real, Holland. if you blink real quick, it isn't flickering. But you gotta be real quick. 
Anyway, Richard Holland right there in that 31 moving up to the fifth spot. All right. For all you statisticians, there you go. What up, nation? Let's go ahead and take this time right now and what? Do a crank it up, maybe? Sure. Crank it up. Bradley is our current race leader. Glenn Jamison, Burt Wilson, Richard Holland, and Nick Hunt rounding up your top five. Why do we always say rounding it off? Why don't we ever say squared off? Squared off in the top five. I don't know. I was still trying to figure out how earlier you said rounding off in the first place. How wide the who? Never mind. A rectangle. Rectangle gets no love. Triangulating the top five. Oh, kind of in a circle. Maybe a square triangulation. Or a D-shaped oval. Or a D-shaped oval. You know what the good thing about all these, uh, the, this truck racing is? What ain't is no, the good thing of this truck racing? Ain't nobody by themselves, so we don't have to listen to you sing tonight. Hey, that's all right. Probably, mm -hmm. The crowd's probably getting sick of it anyway. So Richard I mean. Holland moving up to fourth. Where's that other, oh, Lance Yancey. He's back here in 15th in that other John Deere truck. Back here with Dakota Floyd and uh, Chuck Sweeney. And the fog. And the fog. Winner of tonight's race, the fog. Sixty-seven laps down, and whatever's left goes. We got the candy crew currently holding one, two, and three. Unos dos and trace. I tried my best to stay off of you. Richard Holland sitting there in the fourth. Yeah. Kind of looking like he wants to get around. Looks like this top six starting to break away from the pack. As we get everything under control with two cautions tonight.
John Wimbish dropping down into the pits. Ah, you mean Austin, Ricky, Bobby, Austin, Ricky, Bobby <laughs> Williams or, or something or whatever. I... He is not here tonight. Yeah, he's not here tonight. He's a car racer. Or he's just not here tonight. Or he's just not here tonight. There we go. 70 laps down here in Michigan Motor Speedway in the Automaker 250. Something like that. That's what you got written down. go back here to eighth spot you got brad patterson and cody williams battling it out eight and ninth right there behind him is uh, steve seegers mike mitchell in that number two car or truck and lance yes he's still back here messing around with chuck sweeting and dakota floyd Ivan Jones in that 53. Hal Laney down here, racing along with Paul, Paul Patterson. Michael McCulley, he's got his hands full. Look at this, look at this crew we got going on here. You got Tommy Haynes in the 17. You got, we got Brian Rainville, Elsie Daly. And another truck back there somewhere. Somewhere looks in like, that fog. Yeah, looks like the 33 of Sean Hop. But currently, your race later, Vern Bradley. I thought I think I'd just spit up a little bit. I said Vern in first. <laughs> you know, he's going to fire me one of these days. <laughs> but if you're going to mess with yeah. the bull, if you're going to mess with the bull, go with the biggest one gonna have to find a uh, replacement first right because we've already seen that I can't do it oh you do just fine so looking at the information um, Austin Ricky Bobby Wagner is in the truck listing. Oh, but he's not here tonight. Oh, well, shame on him. Now you know the rest of the story. Burt Wilson's gonna go. Looks like he may try to do a little bit of something, something. Or maybe not. Richard Holland right in behind him with Nick Hunt and then number eight, John Deere. John Deere Green. Ah, 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 ah. 
guy. You don't get to do another song. <laughs> Roy jumping down into pits. What do you think? You think the numbers on the side of that car are three foot high? No. <laughs> Box of the truck is big enough. They could write Billy Bob loves Joe uh, loves uh, Arlene. Sounds like we got a couple of trucks coming down pit road. Lance Yancey just called in and said, Hey, hey, the the go go yeah. and this deer's yeah. done done gone and went. Ah, oh, Jesus, no way. Glenn Jameson, Burt Wilson in the back there, and uh, look at Vern. And what is Vern? All by himself. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That's lap traffic, though. Well, yeah, but he's, you know. That's the double zero right there. Roy Hyde, right on the cusp there. Of, he almost got out. And he's going to succeed in getting his lap back. Go ahead and throw up that pit box. So you out there can at least see something that's not flashing. 63 pitting this time. Oh, Vern on 51 laps on those tires. Vern, our leader, just called in and said, I can't go no more. I can't go no more. I need me some new shoes. There's your race leader. They're going to pop down on pit road there and really screw me up. Disappear. Like a flash. He was gone. Cody Williams. We'll lead that lap. Chuck Sweeney on the outside. He'll gain his lap back. Cody Williams is going to come on down. You're the next contestant on Flicker Way. You know, another reason that it, uh, it, it I know for a fact it isn't me. Everything that's not on the server is not flickering. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Everything else is not flickering. Stats bar is not flickering. Nothing else. Nothing else is flickering. Oh my God. It's getting me sick. It doesn't matter what camera I go to. Put a little blimp cam. 33. Sean Hopkins, the 33, just radioed into his pit. He'll be coming in for some go-go juice. 
And then we're going to go ahead. Right we're going to try to stay with the 60 of Brian Rainville. Simply because That's I don't want to go anywhere near pit road. <laughs> Your pit stop strategy isn't counting right. Well, it can't because of whatever the hell is going on is going on. Let's come back around. That man's going to be your leader again. Yes, sir. Right there. Vern Bradley with Roy Hyde. God bless America. What did you just say? What? Shame on you. Shame on who? You. For what? I can't repeat what you just said. What are you talking about? Because you'll have to watch the replay. <laughs> You said something about committing a big crime. Oh, I did, did I? Something about a water tower. Shame, Shame on you. Okay. Shame. Let me know where you want me to go over when you get here. And we have a breakaway. Look at this. Roy Hyde and Vern Bradley. Three and a half seconds over third spot, Glenn Jameson. Okay, got you. The largest gap we've seen tonight. Brian, did I just glitch on you? Coming up, coming up on uh, Michael Mitchell there in that two car. They're radio back and forth saying, hey, just let me know where you want to go and I'll stay out of your way. Of course, they got to get up there first. 19 laps to go. Burn Bradley and Ray H Roy Hyde. Roy Hyde doing a fantastic job last night. We're going to get through this. There's only 19 laps to go. Hell, we might even have Brazy sing again. Oh, God. God Mike. bless America. Mike Mitchell getting out of their way. Roy, Roy Hyde and Vern Bradley, your race leaders. Apparently, um, Oh, this cannot end like this. Apparently what? Yellow flag, yellow flag. Mike McCauley crashing. Yep. Let's go oh, somebody go to the inside there. Now, That's apparently the it's the afterwards. I pulled in the apron. I went to call, throw a caution and it did. Oh, yeah, he didn't do. There we go. There we go. Hey, 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 slow down. Take a look. Coming in, he lost it all by himself. And he got. He, 
tries to get to the apron there, but unfortunately brought out the yellow flag before he was able to get down there. That was a weird right turn. Yeah, uh, you know, I mean, it was, uh, people have to understand here, you know, sometimes you're not supposed to do right on lefties. Strictly left turn unless you're pulling out of the pit. And then it's not even a right turn. It's more of a fragile yield or merge. Well, there you go. At least they got third caution of the night, and at least they got their pits in. I hope this clears up. Push the pass car. Horrible. So now last time you went to that other side screen. Yeah. Everything settled down for a moment. Other side screen. Yeah, when you popped up things to set your graphics and stuff. Yeah. When you did that, everything settled down for a moment. I don't know if it's Well, it must have been the girl we were talking about last night there, Nation. Well, we're going to tighten everything back up. Burn Bradley, Roy Hyde, Nick Hunt, Glenn Jameson, and Burt Wilson is going to be your top five. Squirt some lemon on that. Tighten it up. I mean, I've heard. There we go. Don't jinx us. Yellow lights are out. We're going to come around and the pace car is going to drop down and then we're going to go green, 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 green. Don't do green. On a hot summer night. EMS said the fool should have used red. Yep. Shouldn't have used red. <laughs> hey, Scar is out. We're about to go back to racing. Goodness. Green, green, green flicker. I literally have nothing. Now that it's flickering real bad, now try clicking to your other screen. I did. I tried that already. It doesn't okay. work. Okay. God. Just, just trying to rule out the computer for sure. Oh, I know it. Like I said. 
I mean, if it was the computer, everything would be glitching. Well, the only reason that I was thinking that it wasn't is because the numbers are staying the same. That's what I'm saying. It isn't, it's not a computer. Or that, I'm sorry, I said that wrong. The reason I was thinking it was the computer is because the numbers are staying stable. Well, I mean, if, like Nick you know what? Loose there. So here's the problem. If it is a computer, then I guess this will be my last broadcast. <laughs> well, it's not funny. I'm telling you. Roy Hyde's going to go up to the front, or he's going to try to get to the outside of Glenn Jameson. At 63, Vern Bradley is able to maintain a little bit of distance. Looks like the sun's finally starting to come out. Yeah. A little yeah. late there. Fucking 10 laps left, and the sun finally comes out and breaks the fog. Roy going way wide. And we are three or four, and who the fuck knows because you can't see the cars. Oh my God. Well, there's a wreck, but no. Checking up for the pace car down here in, uh, I don't know where am I, one and two. I don't know, it's telling me to let you buy it. Oh, never mind. Ten four, thank you. I think it was before that. See, the thing about it is, is even in the replay, they are blinking in the same spot. Now, I don't know how it works. Is that the server is replaying this or it's replayed as it's seen on your computer? No, it would have to download it to my computer if it was being seen on my computer. I, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure how this. How the no, yeah, no, it's not downloading to my computer. It's coming off of the server, which is hosting this race. I don't know. We'll have to go back to technical difficulties and hope for the best. Who knows? Hopefully it'll give us five laps without doing it. We'll actually see who wins this bitch. <laughs> and then we can get the hell out of Michigan. Two members of the candy crew, one and two right now. Yes, sir. Oh, 
on our restart, the yellow light is out on the pace car. On our restart, Vern Bradley, Glenn Jameson, Nick Hunt, Roy Hyde, and Burt Wilson is going to be your top five. Well, let's not go ahead and let's not uh, rule out uh, you know anybody else. You got Richard Holland, Brad Patterson in there, and Travis Smith, Chuck Sweeney, all in the top ten. And Ricky Fagone. And Rick Fagone. Pace car will be dropping off, and we're going to get ready to go back to green. Or disco. One of the two. It's our new mode. Disco, disco mode. Green. Is that like sickle mode? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> And they're off. Burn getting a heck of a good jump on that restart. Six laps to go. That's three laps in flicker wear. Doesn't matter what I do. Doesn't matter what camera I go to. going to drop down to the inside of Vern Bradley. We got five laps, and you know what that means? Five laps means there are no friends out there. And we're going to get a little bit loose, and then we're under another caution. I think that one took out a lot of cars. Like they started to get a three wide and uh looks like uh I don't know. I can't who I can't remember who the trolley car is. You gotta go by me, Dakota. Yep, yeah, sorry. Yeah, if anybody gets a black flag, just clear it on me ball. I'm done. But it looked like he came down and caught uh, Dakota. That was the 42. Brad Patterson. If anyone can. Came down and got caught in the car below him and got loose and went up the track and took a bunch of the wall. Look at that. Look at that. Spot on the track. That's camera. Look at dog coming <laughs> on the high side. That was the camera trying to go to a different angle. Uh, <laughs> right nation. Unbelievable. Flash warning. Flashy shit about to happen. There you go. Trump, too. Could you have a look at 
damage on my truck, please. Ah, look at that John Deere. Now it's just a deer. It doesn't even say John anymore. <laughs> I got caught in the right spot. I'm going to pull up next to your left. Don't mind. Sand four. Thank you, sir. We'll see how the airflow is on that truck. If he can maintain that third spot he's currently holding. He's got Richard Holland and Ricky Fogon right behind him. Hey, so. look at that. We're getting our votes of the day in. 31, 31, 31. Richard Holland. Driver of the day. Get your votes in right now. Richard Holland sitting back here, currently running fourth. Or fifth ish, or sixth ish, or third. I'm good. I think Ricky's going to try and shoot that gap and make it three wide. We got a vote for double zero. And one for Mike Mitchell. to make for an interesting ending three laps to go uh, Roy Hyde your leader Vern Bradley pace cars off John Deere's gonna drop down in green 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 here we go and of course Roy Hyde getting a hell of a jump out there Two laps to go. Hey, is uh, are we gonna we got a back to back here? Possibly, maybe. Possibly. Vern's trying to catch him. He is running him down a little and bit. And Vern is going to get chase him down. Burns going to drive out to the outside. We're going to stick right here because it seems like this camera is not doing too bad. Final lap right here. You got Vern Bradley and Roy Hyde. Roy's gonna stay down to that inside. And he is going to take that win. Roy Hyde is your winner. Vern Bradley second. Steve Seegers is gonna come in third with TJ Lee. TJ Lee in the top five. That, that had to be answered right there. Thanks for the There we go, back to back. Good win, good win, Vern. Now that one goes to Roy. You win, bro. Uh, oh, good win, Roy. Thanks, sir. We'll be back with interviews. Good win, Roy.
go. Get him. Uh, let's get ahead and get our winner tonight, Roy Hyde. You got a copy, Roy? Yes, sir, I do. Back How to back, baby. Back to back. Swept the week. That's so Swept great. Swept Michigan. Awesome. Yes, sir. Oh, at last, I thought Vern had me, honestly, coming off of four. I was like, he's got to run. This is, oh, this is going to be bad. But it pulled out. That was that was really good. That was a lot of fun. Uh, a, a, a few more cautions tonight. Um, yes, sir. We did, and uh, but overall, I mean, it was a good, it was a great race. I mean, you're gonna get that with a pack, pack kind of, kind of pack racing that you get going on here. Oh yes, sir. With these trucks, it's it's pack racing. It's pack racing the entire race. Well, uh, and, uh, any any uh, pit strategies or anything that went on tonight? The last green for we had green flag stops. I went ahead and just I split the the last little bit of it so it'd be even on tires. And I I was worrying because I was like maybe they pitted too early, but yeah, we'll go with it. Already made my bed, got to sleep in it. And a uh, good night's sleep you're gonna get because uh, yes, you gotta sir. win. Yes, sir. That was this was a bad good week. I'm really happy about it. All uh, right, you got anything for uh, Mr. Roy here? Uh, there, uh, Brazy. Just congratulations. I mean, one last night, one tonight. Great race again tonight. Uh, you had, once you got out there in front of, there towards the end, you kind of, between you and Vern, it kind of dominated the last end of the race. So congratulations on that. I oh, appreciate it. Yeah, me and Vern had, had a really, really good race right there. Anyone you'd like to thank, Roy? Oh, always, always. Uh, Isaac and Ava, hey, you guys, I know you're watching. Uh, Back to back, it's a great thing. Mom and Dad, I know you guys are watching too. Um, you guys upstairs, you put on one heck of a show, and I've heard nothing but great things about you guys' broadcast. So good job up there too, and everybody here, just the whole group is it's a it's a good solid league. Well, just don't watch tonight's replay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, say, I don't I don't know who he's who he's talking to, but yeah, I don't know. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> oh, your winner tonight of the Auto Parts or Auto. Maker 250 here at Michigan, back to back wins last night in the Inf I Xfinity car, tonight in the Troik, Roy Hyde. Congratulations, sir. Thank you, guys. Have a good one. Bye now. All right, let's get in the number two. Oh, my God. I can't. I, I was, can, we, can we skip to three? I was kind of hoping that we wouldn't have to talk to him all year. <laughs> you know, I mean, I, I, I do everything I can to avoid talking to this guy. Oh, my God. I know it. CMS, and I, I just do this to you on purpose, I guess. <laughs> How are you doing tonight, Vern? I'm doing really good. I'm about point zero zero eight seconds from doing a lot better, but I'm doing really good. <laughs> well, it was a fantastic race. You had a little mishap there. Brought out the first caution, uh, and uh, but you were able to steam your way back. Yeah, somebody, uh, I, you know, we were racing close up there early, and, and I, I had somebody get into the bumper, and no harm, no foul. I didn't get no damage to the truck, but that I, I figured out something early on in that race, DMS, and I just carried it all night. There you go. There you go. No no particular pit strategy, just get her done, huh? Yeah, just drive it. Drive the wheels off of it, kind of like I do every week, and Usually it backfires on me, but tonight it, it kind of, it didn't pay off completely, but it paid off a lot better. Well, there you go. Anyone you'd like to thank for P2 tonight? Well, I got to thank uh, Burt Wilson for painting these beautiful bazooka paint jobs for me. The bazooka truck was really good tonight. The team worked real hard on it. Good pit stops all night long. And 
Roy Hyde, the d driver of the double zero, the winner tonight, man, my hat's off to him. He protected the bottom well, and he raced me clean. He was a lot of fun to drive with tonight. Well, DMS, you. I want to thank you for being in the booth, all the fans who watch this week in and week out, and just thank everybody. It was a great night tonight. There you go. Anything, Brazy? I was just going to say, you know, it was, it was nice to see that, you know, and even in the beginning, you, you got knocked back, and it was, what, six? 10 laps, you were back up there about top 10 pulling again. So it was, it was really good to see and then seeing you getting second. So congratulations on that. Thanks, Brazy. And like I said, I that's when I found something. When I went out there and took the lead after I, after I wrecked early, when I got back up there and I took the lead, I had found something there. And I, I just stayed with that the whole race. Well, there you go. He found something. I did. I found something, and I'm going to keep it a little secret of mine. Unfortunately, he didn't find the restroom in time, and it's starting to smell up the booth. So Exactly, and I didn't find point zero zero eight seconds, so congrats to Roy Hyde <laughs> once again. <laughs> there you go, ladies and gentlemen, your second-place winner tonight at the Automakers 250 here in Michigan, Broom Bradley. Now we got to hide down and, and find our third place. No, I'm not uh, okay. Um, I don't uh, see third place. I don't see third place. So we're gonna reach down and uh, well, we're not gonna do that either. Oh yeah, we are. There he is. I found Richard Holland. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You know, this is starting to seem like last year. How about you, Richard? You got a copy? I got you. What's happening? Well, look at you, look at you. Coming in eighth tonight, but driver of the day. Ah, uh, nice, nice. Wow, you yeah. you must have some pretty deep pockets to keep paying these people to vote for you. Yeah, <laughs> it gets expensive, but it works. You know, we... <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, yeah, we... I don't know. We didn't, uh, we had a pretty good race. I mean, I think with this type of racing, you're lucky just to finish, you know, and, um, we stayed pretty clean right until that very last caution. And I think most of the people got damaged, but, um, it hurt, it hurt the truck on that last little run there, that green, white checkered. I couldn't go anywhere, but, um, no, nah, had a great race and uh, appreciate Amy nation coming out and, uh, supporting us and rooting for us. I appreciate it. Wish we could have won, but, uh, we'll take it. We'll, we'll take the points and move forward. Well, you know, with the exception of that last caution, you moved up to fourth place, put yourself in a great, put yourself and your team into a great position for a top five, at least a top five. You finished eighth and you were up eight, 17 spots tonight. We had a great field, 32 cars or 32 trucks on the track tonight. And, uh, Hey, a top 10 is a top 10. Yeah, no, that's right. That's absolutely. And, uh, with this field, this, this many people and, uh, this many talented people that can that can get it done. I mean, uh, top ten is, you know, nothing nothing to be upset about. So, like I said, we'll we'll take it. And then and then, like I say, this this type of racing, you're lucky to lucky to even finish these races. I mean, you see what happened there at the end. It just plate racing at Michigan. It's, I mean, it's exciting for you. Probably had a hell of a show, but for us, it's nerve wracking <laughs> and nail, of a show. Oh, yeah, we I, had a hell of a show. All right. <laughs> But, uh, so yeah, you're just lucky. You're lucky to finish these things and, uh, we'll, we'll take it. Well, anyone you'd like to thank? I just want to thank you guys for, for putting on, on this show. Um, you know, we love to go back and watch it and we couldn't do that without you guys doing what you do. So we appreciate it. And, uh, thank everybody for, uh, setting up the league and running it, doing what they do. Um, and the drivers, man, the drivers, unbelievable. Like we just said, 30, what would you say? 32 people, 32, and just great racing all night long really just unbelievable awesome it's really been that way all season great group great group of people uh mm -hmm. it's a lot of fun and and i gotta thank amy nation obviously for coming out and uh like i said supporting us and rooting for us and i uh, appreciate you guys thank you well there you go ladies and gentlemen your vote your driver of the day richard holland congratulations sir thank you thanks guys well you know uh, brazy we are not going to be back to michigan for a while darn and uh you know i i'm i'm gonna have to say that i i'm not heartbroken 
I can't say that I will be either. <laughs> well, any not final gonna thoughts? Miss this, not going to miss this oval D. Oval D. Is that, that's half of a double D. <laughs> uh, maybe that's why it's so messed up. Yeah. Well, we're going to get some work done, and we're going to try to figure out what happened if it was, if it, you know. I mean, you know what, though? We stuck with it. We did the show, and Roy and Vern and Steve all gave us a hell of a show. All the drivers and, did. And look at the track's clear now. The fog is gone. Yeah, I know. Look, uh, sun is shining. Clouds are broke up. No fog. And the race is over. Way to go, Michigan. <laughs> Your final thoughts. I mean, from what we could tell, it was a great race. Um, not going to be missing, not coming back here for, for a while. So, but I, I mean, again, 32 guys out here racing and it's not even all of them. I mean, there's still more to come. Um, I, I look forward to see what the season brings. I couldn't agree with you more. I couldn't have said it better myself. I wouldn't have said it, but Hey, I, you know, if I would have said it, I wouldn't have said it better. Well, at least I didn't interrupt you this time. Yes, there, exactly. <laughs> well, there you go. Again, I apologize for the technical difficulties. We're going to have to figure out what it is, man. And, but we will. And on behalf of WFO Racing Network and myself, Dead Man Strollin, and my co-host, couldn't do it without him, Brazy Bull. Thank you guys for spending your Wednesday night with us. God bless each and every one of you. We'll see you next week. Peace. Night, everybody.